Hi, I'm Dr. Raphael Darvish with Skin Packable Dermatology and Cosmetic Laser Center here in Los Angeles, California, and I'm here today to discuss with you how to diagnose a skin rash. Uh, skin rashes are quite complicated. Uh, it takes many years of training to be able to diagnose a skin rash, but in this short video I'm going to be just explaining the basics of uh, skin rashes. So uh, there are a few different qualities to think about when diagnosing a skin rash. First, where's the location? What's the color? And what's the appearance? So location is a good, uh, good tip as to what this could be. So obviously a rash on the face generally is going to be acne or rosacea or seborrheic dermatitis. Acne being uh, just general acne that most people know, some pustules, uh, painful red bumps, rosacea, flushing red cheeks, and seborrheic dermatitis, some uh, scaly skin on the sides of the nose and up by the eyebrows. Uh, elbow rash generally is going to be um, you know, psoriasis, uh, generally if you have them bilaterally, uh, silvery scaly uh, rashes uh, can indicate psoriasis. Elbows and knees are generally the most commonly affected areas. Bottom of the feet, athlete's foot, scaly rash. Now, in general, uh, when thinking about rashes, what is the treatment? And um, generally, if something is itchy, the treatment's going to be a steroid cream. Uh, now, itchy most commonly refers to something allergic in nature. Uh, eczema, it, it falls under that classification. So uh, again, best, best to leave the uh, treatment options to your doctor, but I'm just giving you an overview. If your rash is very linear in fashion, so say for instance you have something just like a straight line on your uh, skin, uh, that generally means it's something contact related because in nature there are no straight lines. So if you end up with something that's a straight line, then it could be something that you came into contact with. Also, you got to think of location uh, in addition to just the most common areas, but say a random area like your, you know, below your belly button, that's a location that a lot of people, you know, some, uh, that people get a rash at. And um, that's, uh, that's, that's a just dead giveaway for nickel allergy where uh, people are allergic to the nickel on the back of the button of, uh, of their genes. So these are all things that you got to think about. But uh, you know, the, the, the number of different kinds of rashes is very broad. These are just the most basic of basic tips um, that I'm giving you here. I'm Dr. Raphael Darvish and that's a brief overview of how to diagnose a skin rash.